I want to tell you the story about how we manifested this house that we live in, me and my partner. So in 2022, we started to, oh, we decided that we wanted to buy our own house, that we didn't want to rent anymore. And I had heaps of, you know, limitations about that because I'd never owned a home before. Um, and I had a, a lot of fear around money and about worthiness. And I had to work through that with EFT tapping with my mentor um, at that time. So we worked through like a lot of blocks. So we started looking, we went through the process, we got pre-approval um, through the banks, we got a mortgage broker, but then we didn't go with the mortgage broker. We did all of that, you know, kind of boring stuff, but necessary stuff. We do, did all that and then we started looking for houses. And now everything at that time was about 1.1 to 1.5 for like a decent house, like nothing special. And the bank had told us that we could really only borrow about $900,000. So everything that we had been looking at was out of our playing field. So I decided to start manifesting hard, manifesting hard. And I made up this story, this manifestation. And I said to my partner, we are going to be gifted a house. We, there is going to be an older gentleman, real estate agent, or he owns the house. And he is going to gift us this house. He's going to you know, fall in love with us. He's going to really want us to have you know, this house, he's going to love our application, he's going to love who we are. I kept manifesting that for the eight months or however long it took for us to do all these inspections. And we inspected about 50 houses and there were two houses that I really liked, but we didn't offer enough money for, or we put one offer in and it was rejected because they wanted more, which was super disappointing. So we kind of got to the end of our tether and we thought, we're never going to find a house. Like this is... But throughout that entire period, I knew in my soul, in my heart, that we were going to find a house and we just had to keep going because it was out there. And I had a picture of the house that we wanted. We, were, we wanted like an A-frame, older style house with exposed beams. We wanted it to be sort of like country, cottage looking. Um, and that was all of the specificity that we kind of gave the universe on my vision board. <laughs> anyway... So at the end of the eight months, I find this house listed and I send it to my partner kind of as a joke because this house needed a full renovation, like everything needed to be gutted, everything needed to be changed. I sent it to him and he said, oh my God, that's the house. And I thought, what are you talking about? And he said, look at your vision board. That is the house. And so I looked at the vision board. I looked at the picture of the front of the house. Lo and behold, they were pretty much the same house. And I was like, oh my god I got goosebumps but I thought that there's too much work so that fear started to kick in again again I thought there's too much work like it's a full renovation blah 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 and he said yeah that's perfect like we can do it we can do that with our jobs and our lifestyle like we have the time and the skills to do that because my partner used to be a builder I thought oh, okay all right well let's inspect it we inspected it the um, real estate agent is an old gentleman who really loved us and we were the first to inspect it he did like a special thing for us so that we could inspect it beforehand because we couldn't make it to the actual inspection so that was very nice of him and then we got all of our loan stuff approved and he told us the price of what they wanted and they were selling it for land value only land value the house was free so we put our offer in and they approved it the same day and they said sold it's yours <laughs> so we were gifted this house the manifestation that i did about being gifted this house came true we paid for the land that the house is on so even though we still had to pay for something i wasn't that specific with my manifestations and if i could go back i would be more specific but I wouldn't change much so he he gifted us this house and we just paid for the land that it's on and that's how I manifested this house <laughs> so I just wanted to share that with you because that story fucking blows my mind and it's just true evidence that the universe is working with you all of the time you know god the universe whoever it is that you call 
in is working with you and wants the best for you, but you have to want the best for you as well. You have to want the manifestation and you have to be in a place where you can manifest that with, you know, um, a clear mind, with a healed and regulated nervous system, with, you know, the support that you need so that you can just go full throttle, be courageous, take the leap, t- do the inspection, go and see the car, you know, go on the date, whatever it is, whatever it is you're trying to manifest because you really can manifest anything. And I forgot to say that the land value was significantly less than what we had borrowed. So we didn't put ourselves out too much and our mortgage is not, you know, huge, which is what I was stressing over. I was stressing over the money and the mortgage. And that was part of my manifestation to find something that was achievable to my limited mindset at that time. But now that I've manifested a house and have manifested many other things in my life, there is absolutely no limit on my consciousness and what I know that I can achieve now.